heard the tale about the falling star and the savior of our village, hmm? Of course I have. They touched the falling star, was imbued with elemental powers, and consumed the dastardly invaders with burst of flame from their hands! <laughs> As the elders tell it, the savior was cunning. They used powers of deception and misdirection to stalk their enemies like a wraith in the night. Water and ice flowed through them like the currents of the river Nor. But it were the bellowing inferno of flames that brought the invaders to their knees. <laughs> Bridges, buildings, trees, all turned to ash with a flick of the wrist. They were to maniac. They were one with the goddess. The trees and the very crown they walked upon answered their call. They could draw water from a spring and ride it into the ether. They were benevolent and kind, and they saved our people from burning at the stake. The savior weren't a coward who glided upon the mist like a wee fairy. They were a fierce killer who shot fire out of their eyes and stood toe to toe with the demons of the ancient underworld. And they cowered in fear when they as much as glanced in their direction. No, oh, a benevolent magician who is one with the earth! Vicious fire god who's touched melted faces like butter in a hot pan! Kind-hearted spirit and cunning trickster! I not have it! I won't either! Ah! Wildfire, play it your way. Available now.